Hi everyone. I just want to go ahead and do a review here real quick on this SanDisk Cruiser Glide. It's a 64 gigabyte flash drive. And I picked this one up really cheap, probably about half of what half the price what you would expect this to be brand new. Uh, so I mean it's a really good piece here. Uh, the slide operates effort, effortlessly right there. Uh, I did purchase this unpackaged, uh, which normally when you purchase something unpackaged, you've got to look for signs. If, if you can see like real close here, there's scratches on it and so forth. That's only because I've used it. When I received it, it was no scratches on it whatsoever. It uh, does not look like it was tampered with. This is not a sticker here. It's actually imprinted in there. Uh, so this is indeed a legitimate uh, USB flash drive right here. So what I want to do uh, real quick here, since there's not a whole lot to these flash drives, is actually get into the, the meat and potatoes here, really what matters. And that's how quickly you can access files on this flash drive, uh, reading and writing. All right, what we're going to do here is... Uh... 100 megabyte speed test and it's going to write 100 megabytes to the USB flash drive and also read that data so let's see how well this flash drive performs As you'll see it's preparing and getting ready to read. There we go, 26.37 megabytes per second. Now we're in the right phase of the test. And the right phase is 10.37. 23 megabytes per second. These are respectable speeds for a USB 2.0 flash drive. Alright, now that we went ahead and finished that speed test right there, just to see how quickly it could read and write data, uh, I have to say that this, this Cruiser Glide here, I mean, what an outstanding value I picked this up at. I mean, unbelievable. Uh, to think that I picked up a 64 gigabyte USB flash drive from SanDisk for under $30. I mean, it's just unbelievable and free shipping. So, really, with that, I want to get this video uploaded so you guys can go ahead and take a look at it and hopefully hit up that link that I've got in the, in, uh, the description section there so you can go ahead and pick one up for yourself and save a boatload of money. You also see some specifications in there as well, uh, you know, as far as the dimensions of this and uh, UPC numbers and all that fun stuff.